we finally got to see the new characters of 4.7 in their full glory. If you forgot today was the day when Genshin Drip marketed the 4.7 characters Here They Are, we got the beautiful-looking Clorinda, who will be a five-star Elector Sword character. Then we got the cute little Sijuina, who is also a five-star but Hydro Bow user. We got some more info about her constellations and things like that. It is best not to trust this news fully since tomorrow we are getting the full kit details. But according to the new data, her C2 reduces hydro resistance and her C6 increases burst crit rate and crit damage. C6 honestly seems kind of crazy, that it's hard to believe, but I guess tomorrow we shall see. And lastly, we got the stunning and handsome Setos. He will be a four-star Electro character, not sure what weapon he uses, probably the same as Sue, since the trailer for 4.6 said something about them both being gifted and them both having Electro. I mean, there's no reason to have the same weapon type because of that reason. But I'm just saying the data miners probably have the splash art of these characters right now and are also probably trying to get the gameplay and things like that. We should be seeing the full kit of these characters either today or tomorrow. Gameplay should be live this Wednesday or Thursday as they always do. I know a lot of you will be wishing for Arlecchino, and the fund for 4.7 will most likely be low since a lot of people will will also be getting her weapon. I surely will try to get the weapon and Arno, but I need to win that sweet, sweet 50-50 anyway. Getting back to 4.7, this is all we have for now. Dine's Life's Quest has been confirmed by a lot of people to be coming, and there are spoilers for it out there as well. So be careful when looking for 4.7 news. I am not sure when the farming materials for these characters will drop. Usually, they should come later today or early tomorrow. The best thing is that you can farm for all the materials of 4.7 characters in 4.6, since, as you all know, 4.7 won't feature a new map. But there is a possibility for new mobs to come with the new Dane's Leaf's Quest. Just like we got new mobs in the 3.5, Dane's Leaf's Quest with the Quest Locked Map, I'll do my best to cover whatever I can. So, yeah, that's all we have in this video. I just wanted to cover the drip marketing of these cool characters, I would say. Before you all wish on our Arkino, probably wait for the new character animations and proper full kit details. Who knows, you might like the new ones better than Arlecchino. I say this, but I know all of you will wish on her banner day one, including me. So good luck to us all, I hope all of you. But what do you think? Comment down your thoughts, and while you are at it, like and sub too. Oh, and turn on the notifications as well, so you don't miss out on anything. Thank you for watching and have a wonderful day, everyone.